Sam Denis. Sam Denis, the Encyclopedia of Reno Government, and the most trusted name in Reno Government, along with the other D E H N E, Denis. I have to spell that name out because in the Reno Gazette Regurgitator, I found out when the reporters start to write a story about D E H N E, this fellow right here, they get to D E H and suddenly their computer crashes. And it, that's how diabolically afraid and jealous they are of the name D-E-H-N-E. But I do find it interesting that their most important story today is a question as to whether or not you're tall enough to put money in the parking meter. I guess the good news is that at least they don't have another one of those hundreds of dis disconjurcuticulated pictures and thousands of name bites of the puppets and shills that the Reno Gazette and their minions are trying to recruit to run against the best candidate for mayor, D-E-H-N-E. By the way, this young Marine Corps veteran was the challenger for mayor last go around. He was pretty darn close to beating the powerful incumbent, Mr. Cashel. Just a, uh, that was not worth a chortle. At any rate, that's okay. At any rate, as I, as I continue, you know, the Reno Gazette is so diabolical, and the rest of the media for that matter, speaking of that fellow over there, he probably, look at the handcuffs he's got on. He, if he puts a picture of me back to his boss, I guarantee he will be fired. At any rate, we have um, an interesting story here. We've got, we've got a ballot, a, a Reno City Council ballot that has two days, D-E-H-N-E, two days, a father and a son, and we got a ballot that has two Marine Corps veterans on it. Have you even seen anything about that? All you hear about is this career politician vote down there by the judges and a few other nonsensical things like that. As a matter of fact, I can take the blame or the credit for the career politician decision if you even want to go there. They want to say the fellow who filed the motion was... Uh, responsible for that? No. It was Sam Denae telling the judges what to do. Sam talks, the judges listen, as well as other people, although they don't always give Sam Denae the credit. As a, as a matter of fact, I sort of digress here. I have to read a couple of, and this is all you're going to see, these little cards, no billboards. Oh, and by the way, you voters out there in YouTube land and TV land, vote for the person who takes in the least campaign contribution bribes. I like a couple of these little sound bites on here. One, respect our protectors. I never see that by any of the other candidates or anybody for that matter. He also says, this is my really the favorite one. When he is elected mayor, D-E-H-N-E -E is elected mayor, assuming we have an honest vote count this time. He's, he says, they're going to replace, replace the bureaucrats' caviar caviar that the bureaucrats get from the taxpayers is going to replace the caviar with fish sticks.